Have you ever wondered what it feels like to live in the heart of South America, in a country known for its rich culture, breathtaking landscapes, and vibrant cities? Welcome to Colombia. Nestled comfortably between the Pacific Ocean and the Caribbean Sea, Colombia is a land of contrasts, where towering Andean peaks give way to lush Amazonian rainforests, and modern metropolises coexist with centuries-old colonial towns. Here, the equator is a heartbeat away, and the diverse landscapes are as varied as the country's rich tapestry of cultures. This is a place where every city, town, and village has a story to tell. Stories of an ancient civilization that left behind a rich legacy of art, architecture, and wisdom. From the mysterious statues of San Agustin to the lost city of Tayuna, Colombia's history is as intriguing as it is profound. Yet, it's not just the past that makes Colombia captivating. It's also the vibrant present. In Colombia, life is a rhythm, a dance that combines the old with the new, the traditional with the modern. In its bustling cities like Bogota, Medellin and Cali, you'll find a thriving contemporary culture that's firmly rooted in age-old traditions. Here, colonial architecture stands shoulder to shoulder with modern skyscrapers, and salsa music blends seamlessly with the latest global beats. But Colombia is more than just a place. It's a feeling. It's the warmth of its people, the energy of its cities, and the tranquility of its rural landscapes. It's a country that embraces diversity in all its forms, from its varied geography to its multicultural society. This is a place where the old and the new, the urban and the rural, the traditional and the contemporary, all come together to create a unique, vibrant tapestry that is distinctly Colombian. So, what does a day in the life of an average Colombian look like? Let's delve into the daily routine of a resident of Bogota, the capital city of Colombia. With its rich history, dynamic culture, and bustling city life, Bogota is a perfect microcosm of the Colombian experience. Stay tuned as we unravel the enigma that is Colombia. Dawn breaks over Bogota and the city slowly comes to life. In this thriving metropolis, nestled high in the Andes, a typical Colombian household is roused by the gentle hum of life outside. As the first rays of sun pierce the morning mist, the city awakens to the rhythm of daily routine. The sound of roosters crowing, dogs barking, and the distant hum of traffic all blend into a familiar concerto that signals the start of another day. A Colombian morning is steeped in tradition, with the importance of family at its core. In the heart of the home, the kitchen, a symphony of flavors is unfolding. The air fills with the rich aroma of freshly brewed tinto, a strong black coffee that is a staple of Colombian breakfasts. As the coffee percolates, the household gathers around the table, sharing stories and laughter, and building bonds that are as strong as the Andean peaks that surround them. Breakfast is a hearty affair, designed to fuel the day ahead. The table is laden with arepas, a type of cornbread, huevos pericos, scrambled eggs with tomatoes and onions, and changua, a milk, scallion, and egg soup. This is not just a meal, but a ritual that embodies the spirit of Colombian cuisine, vibrant, diverse, and steeped in tradition. But as the breakfast dishes are cleared away, a different pace takes over. The gentle hum of the morning gives way to the rush of the workday. Children scamper off to school, their laughter echoing through the narrow streets. Parents hurry to work, their steps in rhythm with the pulsating heartbeat of Bogota. The city, once sleepy under the veil of dawn, now buzzes with the energy of a metropolis in full swing. As the morning hours roll by, the city pulses with energy and life. But what happens when the workday begins? Each day in Bogota is a testament to the resilience and spirit of its people, who with every sunrise write a new chapter in the story of this vibrant city. In Colombia, the workday is more than just a means of earning a livelihood. It's an integral part of social life and community bonding. Picture this. The sun has fully risen, and the city of Bogota is buzzing with life. The streets are filled with people heading to their respective places of work. There's a sense of purpose in the air, a rhythm that's quintessentially Colombian. The Colombian workday typically begins at 8 in the morning, but that's not where the story starts. The day truly begins 
with a hearty breakfast, often shared with family or friends. It's a time for connection and conversation before the day's duties take over. And in Colombia, this breakfast isn't a quick grab-and-go. It's a sit-down affair, savored with arepas, eggs, and a good strong cup of Colombian coffee. Once at work, the focus shifts to productivity, but not at the expense of interpersonal relationships. Colombians value a warm, friendly work environment. It's not uncommon to see colleagues sharing jokes, discussing weekend plans, or even brainstorming over a problem together. Collaboration isn't just a buzzword here, it's a way of life. And then comes the mid-morning break. This isn't a hurried five-minute pause, it's a genuine 20-minute respite, often spent indulging in a tinto, a small cup of black coffee, while catching up with colleagues. This break is a vital part of the Colombian workday, a time to recharge and reconnect. The work resumes, but it's not a mad dash to the finish line. There's a respect for the process, an understanding that good work takes time. It's this balance between work and leisure, this appreciation for the journey as much as the destination, that sets the Colombian workday apart. Lunch breaks in Colombia aren't just about refueling for the rest of the day. They're an opportunity to step away from the desk, to enjoy a meal with friends, family, or co-workers. In fact, in many Colombian companies, it's customary to have a communal lunch, often catered by local vendors. This is not just a meal, it's a celebration of community and togetherness, a testament to the Colombian spirit. As the afternoon progresses, the pace of work slows down a bit. This is not a reflection of laziness, but rather an acknowledgement of the human need for rest and relaxation. After all, Colombians understand that a well-rested worker is a productive worker. The workday typically ends around 6 in the evening, but the bonds formed during the day continue to flourish outside the office. After work activities, whether it's a game of football or a casual dinner, are common and encouraged. As the afternoon approaches, Colombians gear up for their favorite time of the day, the lunch break. This isn't just an interval, it's a cherished tradition, a testament to the Colombian ethos of balance and community. The Colombian workday, with its unique blend of productivity and leisure, offers a fascinating glimpse into a culture that values both work and play, productivity, and relationships. In Colombia, lunch isn't just a meal. It's an event, a time for family, friends, and colleagues to come together and share stories. This is the heart of Colombia's midday tradition, where the hustle and bustle of the workday gives way to a moment of pause, a time to replenish, reflect, and reconnect. Let's step into a typical Colombian lunch. It's not a grab-and-go sandwich or a hurried salad. It's a feast of flavors, a symphony of textures, and above all, a celebration of Colombia's rich culinary heritage. The star of the show is the Bandeja Paisa, a platter that tells a story of Colombia's diverse geography and history, with elements like beans, rice, fried plantain, avocado, minced meat, chorizo, and a fried egg. It's a meal that satiates and satisfies, a meal that demands your time and attention. But the variety doesn't stop at the Bandeja Paisa. There's the Ajiaco, a hearty soup from Bogota simmered with different types of potatoes, chicken, and corn served with a dollop of cream and a side of capers. Or the lechona, a whole pig stuffed with rice and peas, a delicacy that's a testament to the country's love for communal eating. The importance of food in Colombian culture can't be overstated. It's not just about sustenance. It's about identity, about tradition, about a sense of belonging. Each region has its unique dishes. Each family has its cherished recipes, passed down through generations. This is a culture where grandmothers wield wooden spoons like magic wands, turning simple ingredients into dishes that nourish the body and soul. But a Colombian lunch is not just about the food, it's also about the siesta, a tradition of midday rest that's as much a part of the culture as the food itself. After a meal, there's a pause, a quiet time for people to relax, to digest, to daydream. It's a break from the relentless pace of modern life, a chance to slow down and savor the moment. In offices, schools, and homes across the country, Colombians take this pause seriously. It's not seen as a luxury, but a necessity, a way to recharge and rejuvenate. It's a moment of mindfulness, a time to breathe in the calm and exhale the chaos. This midday break is a reflection of Colombia's values, a respect for balance, 
for leisure, for the simple pleasures of life. It's a philosophy that recognizes the importance of rest, of taking time to enjoy the fruits of one's labor. And then, as the afternoon sun softens, as the echoes of laughter and conversation fade, as the last morsels of food are savored, the siesta ends. It's back to work, back to school, back to the rhythm of the day. But there's a difference, a subtle shift in energy, a renewed sense of purpose. After a hearty lunch, Colombians return to their work or school, recharged and ready to face the rest of the day. As the sun sets, Colombians wind down their workday and prepare for the evening. The transition from day to night in Colombia is a melodious symphony of life slowing down. The bustling streets gradually tune down their tempo, giving way to a more relaxed rhythm. It's dinner time, and the air fills with tantalizing aromas of home-cooked meals. Colombian cuisine is a delightful fusion of indigenous Spanish and African influences with a dash of Caribbean zest. From hearty bandeja paisa to the comforting ajaco soup, each dish is a testament to Colombia's rich culinary heritage. But dinner is not just about food. It's about gathering around the table, sharing stories from the day, and strengthening familial bonds. Colombians value their family time, and evenings are often dedicated to nurturing these relationships. Laughter, lively chatter, and the clinking of cutlery against plates form the quintessential soundtrack of a Colombian evening. Post-dinner, the nation switches to leisure mode. Colombians, known for their zest for life, have a vibrant nightlife culture. There's something for everyone. For the music lovers, salsa clubs echo with infectious rhythms, inviting everyone to sway to the beats. Art enthusiasts might find themselves engrossed in a late-night gallery exhibition, while sports fanatics often huddle around screens, passionately cheering on their favorite football teams. Yet, not all evenings are high energy. Many Colombians prefer quieter pastimes. Some might be found leisurely strolling through beautiful plazas under the starlit sky while others enjoy a tranquil evening at home, savoring a cup of world-renowned Colombian coffee or immersed in a gripping telenovela. The Colombian evening is a beautiful blend of energy and tranquility, mirroring the country's diverse culture. It's a time for food, family, fun, and relaxation. It's a time for Colombians to celebrate the joys of everyday life and to unwind after a day of hard work. As the night falls, Colombians retire for the day, ready to do it all over again tomorrow. Despite the challenges they face, Colombians are known for their resilience and joie de vivre. A spirit that's not just about survival, but about thriving amidst adversity, is the hallmark of the Colombian people. This spirit is a paradoxical blend of grit and grace, of strength and softness, that makes Colombia and its people truly unique. Colombians are an optimistic bunch, they are the sort of people who see the glass as half full, even when it's barely a quarter. It's a part of their DNA, a cultural trait that transcends the boundaries of age and geography. From the bustling city streets of Bogota to the idyllic countryside, optimism is as pervasive as the country's vibrant colors and infectious music. It's like the air they breathe, a part of their everyday life, and it's what keeps them going through thick and thin. But optimism is just one side of the coin. The other side is resilience. Colombians are no strangers to hardship. Their history is dotted with periods of strife and unrest, but like a phoenix rising from the ashes, they have always managed to bounce back. They've turned their trials into triumphs, their obstacles into opportunities. This resilience is not born out of necessity, but out of a deep-rooted belief in the power of hope and the human spirit. It's a testament to their indomitable will and their unyielding faith in a better tomorrow. And then there's their love for life. Colombians don't just live life, they celebrate it. Every day is a fiesta, a celebration of the simple joys and pleasures that life has to offer. They dance to the rhythm of life, not just on the dance floor, but in their hearts and souls. They laugh, they love, they embrace every moment with an open heart and an open mind. They find happiness in the little things, in the everyday moments that most of us take for granted. Be it a shared meal with family, a friendly game of football, or a quiet moment of reflection in the midst of nature, they seize every opportunity to revel in the beauty and bounty of life. 
The Colombian spirit is a beacon of hope and positivity. It's a spirit that refuses to be dampened by adversity, a spirit that shines through the darkest clouds and lights up the gloomiest days. It's the spirit of a people who have learned to dance in the rain, to find joy in the midst of sorrow, to rise above their circumstances and to make the most of what they have. It's a spirit that embodies the essence of Colombia and its people, a spirit that is as captivating as it is inspiring. In Colombia, every day is a celebration of life, a testament to the country's indomitable spirit. So that's a day in the life of a Colombian. But what does it all mean? Let's take a moment to reflect on what we've discovered. From the break of dawn in Bogota, as the city wakes up to the rhythm of life, to the hustle and bustle of the Colombian workday, we've seen a culture that thrives on hard work, dedication, and ambition. In the midst of this energetic work ethic, Colombians also know the importance of taking a breather. The lunch break isn't just about refueling. It's a time for connection, for sharing stories, and for savoring the rich flavors of Colombian cuisine. Here, food isn't merely sustenance. It's a form of communication, a way of expressing love, tradition, and community. As the day winds down, we've seen how Colombians cherish their evenings. Whether it's a family gathering, a soccer match, or a quiet moment of reflection, these hours represent a valuable time to unwind, connect, and celebrate the joys of life. And then there's the Colombian spirit. Resilient, vibrant, and full of life, it's a testament to a nation that has faced challenges, yet continues to dance to the beat of its own drum. Colombians are a testament to the power of hope and resilience, showing us that life, in all its complexity, can be a beautiful dance. Throughout the day, one theme remains constant, the importance of family. In Colombia, family isn't just those related by blood. It's the neighbor who greets you warmly in the morning, the co-worker who shares your lunch break, the friend who cheers with you at a soccer match. It's the community that stands with you, supports you, and dances with you through the ups and downs of life. In Colombia, life is a vibrant tapestry of colors, flavors, sounds, and experiences woven together by the threads of family, community, and resilience.